Hey everyone, how you doing? <laughs> so for the like three of you out there who have actually watched my YouTube videos and you're wondering like if I died or like where I've been or whatever, well basically, you know, like life just decides to do sometimes everything lined up the wrong way and like the what like the month I started my YouTube channel like I just started getting so many issues I had a lot of issues with like my health and like school and just like personal issues and I just I knew that I wasn't gonna be able to grow personally if I had too much to stress about in my life and I suddenly could not take any amount of stress without totally going off the deep end so I just knew that I had to give this a break and just decided that I was going to get well everything I was going to sort out everything before I try to get back into doing this because I don't want to upload crappy content you know I was just getting started I was at a place where it was okay for me to step back and hit the restart button when I was ready so that is what I'm attempting to do right now is hit the restart button things are finally not like at my max stress level anymore so I decided hey why wouldn't now be a good time to restart my YouTube channel you know um so I'm a senior in high school I live in South Carolina in case you didn't know that I mean you might not know that I'm you know I don't know I don't know who watches my videos you might be from my high school you might be from Wyoming. I don't know where you're from, but whoever you are, thank you for watching this video. Even if you're watching it because you don't like me and you're like laughing or whatever, you know that that's fine too. All right, we got homework, we got scholarship applications, we got you know, we got work, we got this and that and the other, you know, we got stuff to do we got things to shop for we've got christmas we've got life going on we got appointments and then my brain's like okay but let's make a youtube video so you know me and my d so you know me and my no self-control are making a youtube video we're making a YouTube video. Not gonna do that. Okay. So, basically, you know, my other YouTube videos have been about makeup, right? Well, recently I've kind of gotten addicted to plants ever since watching this YouTube channel. Um, it's called, her name's Harley G. I'll link it down in the description. But since I started watching those videos, I just like, I got into plants. Like, I wanted to literally make my house into a jungle okay so like we were on a mission we were on a mission to go get all of these plants you know I was thinking okay this is gonna be fun and then I looked at my bank account and I have three dollars and sixty cents so so you know I'm addicted to plants now so you know what we're doing we're going plant shopping and I figured hey let's switch it up on the channel a year and a half we're back I'm sorry I clap a lot I need to like not do that um we are back switching it up we're gonna go to two local Lowe's not the one in the town that I live because I've already been there and it's just not that impressive at the moment so we're going to venture out to a town near where I live that I'm pretty sure there's two Lowe's in because it's like a big like group of townage so I'm pretty sure they have two Lowe's 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 okay I have most of the plants that in my um, house now because of the YouTube channel that I mentioned earlier like the suggestions that she made about plants to get and I went to a nursery like a local nursery around where I live and I found a lot of like the more specific plants that I thought were really cool and weren't like two hundred dollars I only found what like two I think two or three at Lowe's that I like had on the list that I had made from just doing my own research kind of already being a plant junkie and then watching those YouTube videos so let's just go check it out you know let's just let's let's go shopping for plants you guys 
Okay y'all, I was planning on just checking in when I got to my location and I thought, okay, there's maybe one or two Lowe's, like Lowe's, I don't know, Lowe's, 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 there's like two Lowe's around here, right? Well, I just looked it up. There are five Lowe's within 14 miles of where I live. So, you know, we're gonna just, this is gonna be an adventure, you guys. Okay, oh, my camera is the wrong way. Okay. Last check-in before like either you get like a clip of me driving or like we're at a Lowe's because I just need to check in again because you know I just realized I have not put a video out on YouTube for a good year and a half and I literally did not open the video with saying hi my name is Gracie so I just wanted to add that in here because I'm an idiot so you know just we're just rolling with it. I'm not gonna lie, I'm walking through the Lowe's parking lot and I just realized that I filmed the entire indoor part the wrong direction. Okay you guys, I just got out of Lowe's number one as you just saw some of the really crappy filming that I took. Honestly, that was a bust. They did have a ZZ plant, which I was impressed by because they did have a way larger selection than the Lowe's closest to me because they had a ZZ plant for $13 and it was like, it looked pretty healthy, which I was actually kind of happy about. I'm not getting one of those right now because they are like toxic to sensitive skin and I just want to get plants that I don't have to be afraid to touch when I'm like first growing my collection. But um, one of the other plants that I really like is called um, Peperomia. I'm really looking for a watermelon Peperomia, which I'll probably end up ordering from Etsy. We'll see about that, but they had teardrop Peperomia and variegated Peperomia in there. The teardrop one was like having some kind of health issues. The plant itself is a little like kind of flimsy and kind of like a really pale greeny look anyways like it just it looked kind of sad but then the leaves had a lot of brown edges and decaying and it just like I mean just it just wasn't worth it even like the plants weren't looking the best you know and I was just thinking okay there's like four other lows I could go check out and see if they have that so I'm gonna do that before I decide if I want to come back here and get a plant that I'm gonna have to work a little bit harder for you know so that's what we're gonna do all right, y'all, we are walking up to Lowe's number two. So let's see what we can find here. And I hope this car stops at the stop sign because I'm not interested in getting run over today. Okay, everyone, we are now heading to Home Depot. Now that I've been thoroughly disappointed by two lows so far and um you know I just want to get like one plant today so we're gonna go to Home Depot you know hope for the best so yeah we're gonna go to Home Depot we're gonna hope um that they like pull through for us and then we're gonna go home okay you guys I didn't even film in that Home Depot because you know I felt like if I had video evidence that I had to watch over again when I was editing this video of such a terrible experience it would make me relapse in my depression that was the saddest thing I've ever seen they had like no plants like no they had one kind of peperomia and it looked so sad they had several of like the most basic plants but they didn't have any like spicy stuff, you know? I'm going home empty handed. Well, you know, even though this was a bust, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'm gonna insert a little clip that I took of my plant collection just to like end this video on a happy note because right now I'm very sad. So here's my plants thank you for watching hit that like button you know shoot me a comment like uh subscribe do whatever tell me what kind of videos you want to see because obviously i have no idea what i'm doing literally taking y'all shopping with me for plants in um 30 degree weather in december so um yeah so here's my plants bye mm -hmm.